What's up, everybody? You're getting your daily dose of motivation. This is episode 205. I wanted to talk to you guys about my current situation. I feel like I get stressed out a lot, as I'm sure you do, since we're all human. We have everyday stresses. The current, present day stresses that you have, you gotta think about where you came from. You gotta think about where you're trying to go. It can all get confusing, a tornado of emotions. I know for me anyway. So I think thinking of my past too much can get me stuck. Thinking of my future too much can get me stuck. Because if you're going one way or the other and you're not present at all, you're gonna get stuck. And I've been through that in this journey of mental and physical, uh, you know, bettering myself. And I just wanna say in the current day, when I get really stressed out about my bills that I have, about uh, my weight that I'm at right now, about my mental health, uh, when I get frustrated and I make mistakes, you know, nobody's perfect. I don't give a shit what the media says, what Hollywood says, nobody's perfect. So here's the deal. I was thinking about how in the past, I don't know if you guys know this, I talk about it all the time, it's a pretty big deal, I used to weigh 619 pounds. Right now I'm not like insanely far from that and I have a lot of work to do, but even where I'm at right now, I already feel so much better. And I think about the past. I used to be stuck in my house. And I say this all the time because I want you to know where I'm at right now and, uh, and compare it to where I came from. And I try to remind myself of that all the time in the present day when I get really stressed out, when I think that I can't do something or I feel hopeless in any moment. I think about where I came from and I try not to get lost in it and make, you know, sometimes when you're sad and you're feeling bad, you try to pile more stuff on. I don't know if that's like a self punishment type of thing or just feels good to kind of feel some sorrow for a minute or maybe when you've had so much tragic stuff happen in your life you think that slipping back into that very very sad and hopeless and whatever feeling is comfortable because you're so used to it you've done it so many times in your life you just want to pile everything on and i'm trying to fight against that i'm trying to change that mental process and i'm doing a good job i i feel like it in the current day you know, I have a lot more work to do, but I'm telling you, I'm a lot happier. So I think about the past though, and I try to use it as a tool to better myself now in the present, and then obviously the future. So when I was over 600 pounds, living my 600 pound life, I was so fucking uncomfortable. I was in so much agony, pain-wise physically, pain-wise emotionally, I was depressed, beyond belief, I was at the edge of suicide. I was right there. Um, I was just empty inside and it was just, it was almost over for me. And it was the hardest thing that I've ever gone through in my life. I remember every day I would lay in my bed and I would listen to music and I would fantasize about a future. I fantasized about having normal people stresses normal functioning adult stresses you know outside of the house leaving getting to work out uh paying bills having a job all the normal everyday stresses that the average person you know complains about which i have found myself doing in the current day and when i do i immediately remember those times where i was over 600 pounds and just couldn't even sleep comfortably. I couldn't move. I couldn't live life at all. In any way, I couldn't function correctly. And now, even though I still have a lot more work to do physically and a lot more work to do mentally in this current day, I have those stresses that I was fantasizing about. Those uh, fantasies and dreams to be working out, even if it's just being able to walk a little bit, I'm doing that. I've hiked so much, I've walked so much, you know, and, I, and I've made so much progress uh, mentally and I'm just so happy about it. Right now, today, like I said, when I get really, really stressed out, I think about the past just enough to use it as a tool so I can keep moving forward 
and uh, I just keep focusing on the progress that I've made, where I've come from, and I'm so much happier right now, and it gives me hope and it helps me to know that I can be even happier than this. I can be a better person for myself and the people that I love. So that means you can do it too. And this is the whole reason why I'm doing this journey and why I'm filming myself every day is to document it, to look back at this progress and use it as tools for the present and for the future, but also to show you that you're not alone. So whatever you are going through right now, if it's really stressing you out, if it feels like it's an impossible situation, you're not gonna make it through, try to think back to your past to maybe something that was similar to it or maybe worse. Try to use it in a healthy way so that you can feel better about the present and feel hopeful for the future because you are strong enough to get through whatever you're stressed out about. And we can get emotional and it, be it can become overwhelming, but guess what? You're human, you're allowed to feel this way. Just make sure that you vent it out, you work it out, and remember that you're a very strong person and you can make it through anything, all right? So whatever you're doing, whatever you're going through, I'm right here in the present with you, going through some shit too. Much love.